last year we announced that we were in process of offering Cool Fusion 10 on Amazon Web Services cloud infrastructure. And it gives me immense pleasure to tell you that we have now released Cool Fusion AMIs on AWS Marketplace. So uh, for the people who do know uh, what an AMI is, I would briefly explain the key concepts behind. So, uh, okay, so to begin with, what is EC2? EC2 or uh, Elastic Cloud Computing is the Amazon's cloud infrastructure that they give out to users on rental basis. So uh, what you can do is you can you can get as much compute capacity that you want on demand from Amazon's cloud for your needs. So uh, the, the key concepts uh, within this infrastructure include instances which are nothing but virtual machines of, of various sizes. Consider them as physical servers that you have in Amazon's cloud. AMIs or Amazon machine images are nothing but bootable images uh, through which you can create copies of these instances. So what you do is you uh, You'll, you'll, you'll create these images uh, with in installing your application, your servers and all the things that you uh, that your server needs to get started and then you can create these instances on the fly as, as the situation demands using the, these AMIs. Now security group, this acts as a, a, as a peripheral network uh, firewall which regulates any access to your EC2 instances. And last but not the least, Elastic Block Storage or EBS. These are nothing but persistent storages that are available to you in the cloud uh, in infrastructure. Consider them as, uh, as, as, as some hard disk that you have in which you can store your files uh, persistently that will be available to you even across the server restarts. Now, uh, whenever you'll start or uh, w w whenever you, you'd go about creating any instances, the first thing you'll do is you'll, you'll select a region. Now these regions are uh, places where Amazon have their uh, data centers. So they have roughly around eight data centers across the world and each data centers have uh, something called availability zone. So uh, these again are the actual data centers, the physical data centers that are there. And then, uh, so these availability zones are interconnected with high speed data cables, such that the transfer, data transfer between these are, are very, very uh, high. So uh, you, you, you'd select a region based on uh, the proximity with you uh, or the prices each each region has its own pricing structure so you uh, probably would like to consult that before selecting a region so once you have selected your region you can uh, go ahead and start building your applications uh, so uh, why should you look at uh, AMIs uh, the, the code fusion provides the first uh, first and foremost is the purchasing options now you can have as many cool fusion servers as you want on demand basis without any upfront payment and you can pay for usage by the hour what i mean uh, what i mean by this is you can uh, you can create as many instances depending on the load on your server depending on how much network bandwidth uh, you need at any point of time uh, without actually going and provisioning uh, licenses for cold fusion the licensing is in bundled with the amis and it will be charged for the usage by the art so uh, on windows and ubuntu on the large instances, uh, the cool fusion will charge 15 cents per hour, and on extra large instances, uh, it'll 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 charge uh, 30 cents per hour. Now, uh, 
more about the AMIs that we have. Uh, on Linux, we have Ubuntu uh, of um, 12.04 LTS long-term support with Coalfusion 10 with the latest update 7 installed. We have Apache latest version with it and uh, we have uh, a MySQL DB installed in, in, these, in this AMI. For the Windows version, we have Windows 2008 Server R2, Fusion 10 with update 7, uh, web server is IIS and DB again is MySQL. For the JRE, uh, will 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 be on 1.7.x and all the, con the the connector is configured for all the sites. For more information, you can go to Coolfusion AMI's product homepage listed on the screen, or simply search for Coolfusion in AWS Marketplace. You can also visit help at adobe.com for more documentation around the same. In the follow. In a follow up video, we will walk through how to create these instances with Coolfusion AMIs. So until then, this is Chandan Kumar from Coolfusion Engineering team. Thanks for watching.